Standing with the main man himself, Joshua Thank Kane, you Christopher much. Rayburn, Daniel Lismore, father and son, sensation, Charlie and Joe from Casey Hayford. I'm here with Aggie and Sam. This is the amazing Kevin Luckman from Tony and Guy. Ollie Cheshire. Hello. Musician, style icon, Dougie Pointer. How are we feeling, brother? Very good, thank you very much. LCM is one of my favorite events of the year. It just shows some of the amazing designers, the amazing creativeness and energy that's going on in London right now. Um, and to be a part of it is, you know, incredible. What do you think it is about London in particular that's so exciting when it comes to men's fashion? I, I genuinely think in London, not only are you encouraged, but you, you feel from the beginning that you can do anything. You have all these talents and they come out of the woodwork and all of, all of a sudden they're superstars. And London nurtures that. There's so much art and music and everything, it really is like a melting pot. I think it's, it's the raw energy of London, I don't I haven't found that anywhere else. You know, it's constantly evolving, constantly challenging. London has an amazing history of making the most beautiful suits. And for me, it kind of that follows through into even the like the modern streetwear brands. They still have that element of tailoring in them. When it comes to style or comes to individuality or if you're unsure of certain things, just make sure that you're true to yourself. One thing I keep throughout my style is I always accessorize. So I wear these kind of silver rings and they're all very different. So I wouldn't be afraid to kind of mix it up a little bit. So if you check out my brand, it's Serge Denim. Um, and I would say it's a sort of premium streetwear brand. It's all about being young, being creative. I think confidence, a lot of it comes from being comfortable. So whatever your style is or whatever it is that you feel comfortable in, just rock it. Don't be afraid to rock it um, because individuality and being unique is the most glorious thing. Let's get out of this black cab, back into LCM and see what's going down. Oh, I, I've known you since you know you started the brand. Two and a half years, I think. Only two and a half years, and to see what you've achieved in such a short period of time. To be honest, mate, I'm blown away. I'm super proud of Thank you. Thank you very much. How are that. you feeling right now? I feel good. It's always a very strange transition into working more than 24-7 on a project for six months. And then as soon as it ends, and a show like that where it's silent. Yeah. You couldn't even hear anyone talking, it was, it was very sort of emotional and that was the point of it. It's not about necessarily doing the best design in the world, it's, it's about creating a, a luxurious product and a luxurious environment and hopefully creating someone with a little bit of soul in a time where there's a lot of, there's a big lack of that in my opinion. How are we feeling? Exhausted. Exhilarated. Ex exhilarated. <laughs> you're you're exhausted. exhausted. You're exhilarated. Absolutely. Give me three style tips. Ooh, damn, style tips. <laughs> How do you like working in this pressure? Do you enjoy it? Yeah, I mean, to be honest, yeah, I tend to work over there where the air conditioning machine is, you know. Very tactic. good shout from you. But you've done well. If you see here, Ollie's wearing some shorts right now. Get them out. Get them legs out. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's always, you know, it's kind of being head of the hair, you're always under pressure. Uh, you've got to think quick off the mark, but it's good to have like amazing people to help you backstage. Um, you know, people that's always going to have your back as well. Um, but now, how do you feel it went? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's I can tell you, I watched it. Yeah. It was amazing. Notice how Dougie is so on point with his earring. You see that? Dangly uh, earrings. Uh, yeah. That's where it's at. <laughs> I mean, what was the main inspiration behind this collection? Um, well, we were looking at uh, two uh, genres of music, but at their core and at their origins, so 90s grime and then 70s rock. It sounds quite like minimal and plain and boring. Right. I'm quite, so like, you're trying to, and, and you're bringing in the, the loud patterns, the, the matching exactly, yeah. sets. I like to jazz it up. Super jazzy. I think, um, like, I've seen it for the last three, four years coming on and coming on. It's just grown and grown. I think the production on the materials and the craftsmanship that's all put together just looks outstanding and very professional. And I think it's going to sell really well, this collection. First tip is always to maintain that you have like your own integrity like you work out who you are what you want to do how you design don't try and look at other people just think about like 100 yeah trying to like, get your own yourself. identity just be yourself man dude just that's <laughs> what i always say man it's true me and daniel peace out love you brother thank you